Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News, your morning news update for this Monday, October the 3rd. Tonight on Chill TV, 6 o'clock live on the YouTube channel. Uh, you'll be able to watch the Chilliwack mayoral and councillor debates. It is a live stream. It is going to be uh, at UFV. And uh, we are going to be on the air from between 6 and 8 p.m. taking your questions as we are getting uh, very close to Election Day for the municipal elections, which is coming up October the 15th. All the candidates are now up, up on all the various websites. So if you're looking for the city of Chilliwack, village of Harrison, district of Kent for Agassiz, uh, the city of Abbotsford, Cultus Lake, just go to their respective websites and all the names are there. Now, what we are noticing is that uh, advanced polling is this week. The mail-in ballots should be starting to show up in your mailbox. Uh, Lewis Point, who was running for Chilliwack School Trustee, he pulled his name out last Wednesday, but it appears his name is still going to be on the ballot even though he is not running. So that might cause uh, a little bit of confusion. A couple of other things on the go. Yes, September was another record for weather, warmest and driest ever ever for a month. And we thank Roger Panetta, Environment Canada, for that information. Uh, you remember Ethan Fleming, the young man who was battling cancer. Uh, sadly, uh, we, he lost his life a couple of weeks ago. Uh, this is a young kid who uh, had so many surgeries and still kept up a brave face. He wanted to get back to school. Uh, Ethan's mom got a hold of Fraser Valley News and Chill TV. There will be a public celebration of life in November, we have the information up on FEN. Again, a big thank you to Ethan's family. Uh, I'll definitely be there. There's something we should know about, as always, FEN at Shaw.ca. Also a reminder, this coming weekend is Thanksgiving, another long weekend, but it's also the 40th anniversary of Rambo. And we do have tickets to give away courtesy of Envision Financial and Brian McKinney and the group there. Uh, and yours truly will be part of the ceremonies celebrating 40 years since the first First Blood movie. And there's some surprises. Won't give it away. Have yourself a great day. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.